Good morning, Portsmouth School Department. Greetings from the creek uh, and from my morning walking commute today. So a couple things as we head into this week, I just wanted to make sure people were aware of. The first is that if we had any illusions about the fact that uh, Portsmouth, excuse me, that COVID was not going to affect our operations this year, those were dispelled in this past week. We had a bunch of staff members who were affected and a bunch of students who were affected during the last week with folks missing time. That's frustrating, disappointing. I know we're all looking forward to kind of moving on and moving back to quote unquote normal. Um, but I think our new normal is gonna continue to evolve over the years. So with that in mind, I also wanna let you know and I'll include some stuff down below about how to get into it, that our school nurses uh, went ahead and started to create. We've been turning in information to the state that people can look at on a weekly basis, uh, but our school nurses have created a new graphic that will allow you to track cases in the district uh, pretty much from day to day. So um, we'll, if you look down below, I'll include information on how to uh, access uh, that data so you can make you know informed decisions about what you're doing uh, at home and you have a broad understanding of what we're doing here in the district. The, uh, the other thing kind of I think intertwines with that and I just wanted to say that as I am going through uh, my process of getting to know the district uh, it's great to identify certain strengths that are present here in uh, Portsmouth. And I think the thing that's really stuck out to me is while we just were about to move into this kind of frustrating reintroduction of COVID having an impact on our, um, our operations and everybody's lives, I know we were dealing with it at my house this week, uh, that what really shone through for me in a variety of ways in the last two weeks is the one of the superpowers that Portsmouth School Department has is the positive contributions, ongoing positive contributions of parents and families. And that comes in a lot of different forms. It comes in the ways in which people participate in PTOs, um, PTAs across the district, um, boosters, things like that. It also comes in situations where when we have to have conversations between schools and parents, that parents come to the table with a belief that the schools are working really hard to do the best they can and that we should be partners. And I'll be honest, that's not something that's present everywhere right now. We're in an interesting period in society. So I just wanted to tell you that I deeply appreciate that about this community and being part of that. And in the midst of some ongoing challenges, parents, you can be the power, you know, kind of the, the afterburners for us to to do more than we would be able to do on our own. Uh, and it's all about those partnerships. So I just want to thank you for that. I hope you have a great week. Let's hope that uh, some of the COVID stuff slows down a little bit so we can be more fully staffed than we want to be. And uh, we appreciate everybody working with us. Have a good week, everybody.